Hello everybody, my name is Soundbite, and welcome to Get Bit. I am joined with Terabyte tonight. Hello, I'm hiding. And we are going to be playing Water Dome. So let me give you a little background. Soundbite's mad at me. I, no, I'm not mad. Just it's just that you fucking shot me. What? <laughs> we were playing Unturned right before this, and he put up a shield. I mean, if you've seen the video, you know what happens. But he put up a shield and proceeded to think that his katana would take it down. His katana was an outfield. <laughs> well, a, a revolver. Well, but... it was powerful as it. <laughs> My God! All right, so this map makes you spawn in a glass dome underwater. The water's surface is covered by stone and bedrock, so building on the surface is impossible. This is your classic survival map. You can do whatever you want and have challenges to complete as well. You, is that is that this intro that you're reading? I'm reading off of what the uh, thing says. We've got a bunch of challenges to do. Oh, I think you just picked up the intro. Oh, I just picked up the intro. Well, let's read the intro. I was going to get to the challenges, but you know. We'll get to the challenges after the intro. All right. In this survival map, as if you couldn't tell already, you're in a... Oh, you're... It's <laughs> <laughs> the wrong you <laughs> <laughs> Oh, so there isn't exactly a surface to get to. Food. As you can see in the chest provided, you only have a few potatoes to go on for now. Other sources of food will have to be collected from grass, leaves, found in chests, or collected from moobs. Minerals. Ores will generate normally, and mine shafts are everywhere. Okay, not completely everywhere, but they are slightly more common than mine shafts in a normal Minecraft world. Oh my god, page four out of eight. Oh my god. Exploration. As you can plainly see, ocean monuments naturally generate down here. There are also other domes besides the ones you are in, and a particularly difficult water village. Its inhabitants aren't interested in trading, though. No. Oh, okay. Are those all the other domes out there, though? Yeah, it seems like it. They might be. Other. When it rains on the surface, the rock somehow changes and starts to affect all living entities below. This can come in many forms, ranging from resistance, form, harm, and player... Resistance, form, harm, and players. Resistance to increase from... speed in hostile mobs. Uh... There's a bug in 1.8 where guardians don't spawn in their monuments, only elder guardians. He fixed this by adding monster spawners. And the closest monument only has one elder guardian. Do you have, like the map or have a suggestion for it? Go to here we are and leave a comment. We will do that. Thanks for playing. Enjoy. All right. Thank you. I want to make sure I thank the correct person this time around. We are thanking Josh Osh 34 you corrected the wrong, or you thanked the wrong person before? No, 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 no. I just want to make sure that we're thanking the person. Oh, you yes. said... So, thank you, okay. Josh Osh. Can I punch the tree now? Yeah, just don't break the one that the platform's on. Okay. Okay. Take down the entire stump. Oh, I got the wood. Thanks. Huh. Got that one. Was I supposed to have made that into a joke? I'm gonna leave some wood up there. All right, I'm gonna make the crafting table. Okay, hopefully this will. There's more wood. I don't know what we're. Are we just supposed to like? Are we just okay, supposed to survive? Challenge? Oh, like, challenges, challenges. Yeah, I told you. All right, well, let's get to the challenges then. So, challenge. Yeah. Let me thank you, Inori. Okay. So, challenges. Bur bah, bird. Build a furnace. Well, let's uh let's start. <laughs> okay, buddy. I'll All right, I got pickaxe. eight dirt. That's enough for a furnace, right? I'll make a pickaxe. All I got sand down here. And whatever the heck that is. Oh, clay. Clayton. Oh, thank you, sir. I had no idea that you were walking in front of me. All right. Stone. Found, you it. found it? Nice. <gasps> oh, no, never mind. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's pretty great. Alright, so I see no need for weapons at this point yet. No, I don't either. So I'm just gonna place down uh, that for a tree. It'll grow later. That'll grow later. Probably not. Seeds over here away. Here away, there away, everywhere sale. Or. There we go. Furnace. Oh, maybe I should close Skype too. Because <laughs> that's smart. Yeah, that would um, like the shit Challenge out of one. Time. Furnace. Easy. All right. Now. Oh, God. Challenge two. Expand the dome. I can wow, know. like that level. Of the difficulty curve in this is fucking stupid. <laughs> <laughs> you seeing what I'm seeing? Because I'm seeing some shit. 
I'm okay. not seeing anything out there. I'm just okay. Seeing... Make a wheat farm. Well, check done. Already done. Make bread. Uh, that's gonna take a little bit. Make a melon farm. Eh, eh, it won't take us long. Make we a pumpkin find... farm. Done. Yeah, there well, you go. Done yeah. and done. <laughs> <laughs> Make a reed sugar cane farm. Done and done. Done. Make a cactus farm. Ooh. <laughs> well, anyway. I think we know what we're gonna do today. <laughs> Wanna go find wow, this some... dude? Like this dude literally completed most of our challenges for us. This dude's nice. <laughs> oh dear! Find all the domes in the overworld. Oh. oh. Um. How do we know we find them all? Uh, good question. I don't know how many there are. Let me find out. I mean, seven. Oh, overworld. there's eight domes. We need to find in the overworld and one in the Nether. Why would there be a dome in the Nether? I don't know, but I can't see shit out here, so I don't know why I'm going. That was a poor yeah, life choice. I'm kind of confused on what we're supposed to do. I think we just need to dig down. All right, I'm digging down. All right, can you get me like some stone for a stone pickaxe? Yeah. All right, I could really use that. Um, I wish. Oh, we're gonna need to burn wood for coal because I doubt there's gonna be any down there. Well, I'll start start planting more trees. Yeah, I will. I'll get right oh, on that, mate. Where the fuck did I go? Mm. Oh, well, thank you. I need two more. <laughs> <laughs> you ding a ring. You didgeridoo. You dirigible. I, I, wonder if, I wonder if there's any caves down here. You're a dirigible, Charlie Brown. <laughs> you know I can't break this shit. Fucking stand I'm up. not in the way. <gasps> it broke. <laughs> what? Pickaxe broke. Wow, smacking me in the face broke your pickaxe. <laughs> Anything else you want to break, like wind or some bad news? <laughs> <laughs> that was actually really good. I got to give that one to you. <laughs> I'm crying. Oh, God. <laughs> My face is red. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it great that we're friends? I actually enjoyed that very much. Isn't it great that we're friends? Oh Imagine God. if we weren't, we'd still probably call each other names. Oh yeah, probably. All right. Oh my God, I, I just hate John and his constantly positive <laughs> attitude. Man, I got nothing on you. I really wow. don't. This is like that one Cedar Point trip we took, and he's like, oh, "Tell me the dirt on this guy." I'm like, "I don't we, have we, any." We, like we, <laughs> yeah, we actually don't. Like we're not uncomfortable with anything. <laughs> That's the deal. No, it wasn't the fact that it was uncomfortable. We just don't fucking know each other enough to have any dirt. What are you talking about? We don't know each other enough. We talk so much, and it's not really dirt because it's just friend talk. Yeah, I it's guess not that's really, friend like, talk. We don't really have any dirt on another. I could say, "Oh, this dude has super stupid hands." <laughs> and I'm I'm refraining for the R word because we realized that it probably offends yeah, a lot of people. Yeah, because super stupid's not offensive. Well, it shouldn't be at least. It's mentally declined. I'm sorry, deficient. I, I think deficient means they don't have a mind, so we might want to we might want to refrain from zombies using that, the word way. Deficient that way. Mutants. You don't talk. Don't talk to zombies that way. <laughs> don't use the Z word. Well, I hit bedrock. Did you really? How far yeah, down I'm, is that? <laughs> fucking uh, F three. Good God. On that Y one. Do you still have that water dome book, or do? Because I don't have it. No, I put it in the chest. But there were two of them, weren't there? Yeah, I put it in the chest. But there's only one in here. Oh, what? Oh, I have it. Oh, okay. So you lied! I guess. Wow, so there's literally nothing down here. Yeah, there's uh, so? not a whole lot to do. I'm not quite sure what we're aiming for. Do you think we're too deep? No, I think we're fine. Okay. Yeah, we're probably too deep. We're at one. <laughs> y equals one. <laughs> Uh, 20 sounds uh, like a good number. Yeah. I'll follow in your footsteps, maybe the other direction. So, like, I, uh, I, can't I don't know. Like, oh, iron! Oh, bazinga. Good find. Bazooper. So, like, I, I don't know. I just never liked Skyblock, but that one... Now, why didn't you like it, though? Just Skyblock on its own. I just There's always that threat, I guess. Like, don't get me wrong. I love... The threat of what? I'm story, and I love, I love survival challenges. I love something to give me a challenge, but just... In the modded version of that, oh, I wish I could remember what it was called. But, um, it was like, it used the same, like, did I tell you about that Crash Landing mod? Crash pack? Landing. Any Crash Landing mod pack? The super hard quest, quest book mod pack, but the hardcore quest mod? Oh, is that the one where you crashed on a desert island or something? Or like on a, a desert, desert planet? planet? Yeah, I on remember watching the, yeah. one of the other YouTubers play through that. 
Yeah, yeah, and see, I loved that, but see, like, all the challenge for me died once I got wheat. Because you could survive. Yeah, and it's uh... like, it, it, there's nothing pushing me to explore more. Cole. Why? There's always the, the curiosity of what's out there. Well, yeah, but I mean, I guess I'm just not much I'm of an I'm trying adventurer. to turn you down. Oh, I'm a No, no, I understand, adventurer. and I guess it's just like... I'm not much of an adventurer. I, I think that's the issue. Yeah, I like to I like to go out and find new things, which is why if I make a modded server, it's really hard for me to settle down because there's always something new to find. You know what? I think we should probably play Crash Landing together. Crash Landing? We should probably mm. play Crash Landing together. I don't know. We're pretty bad at these survival maps. Well, but that has a quest book that'll tell you like what you can work for. Oh, is it modded? Towards. Yeah, it's a modded survival. What uh, version of Minecraft is it? One point six. Oh, okay. Wait, it, it's way back when. Yeah, one six four. I think it was. It's That's way not back too bad. When. Yeah, the one point seven server jars just aren't working for me for some reason. I don't know why. Hopefully, we can get the. Uh, if we ever try to, if we ever actually try it, hopefully we can get the. Uh, modded server. Thing. up? Yeah, a modded server. Up oh, I found a problem with uh, the uh, the server that I made. The uh, not the server, but the mod pack. Hmm. So I added in a mod that gives you all of these uh, different dimensions, and there's supposed to be enemies spawning from them, but there are no enemies for those specific dimensions, so it's not you can't really advance anywhere. Really? Yeah, and like the difficulty of the game is just set on zombies, skeletons, and creepers. It's really weird. So, so all it spawns is the regular mobs? Well, not in those other dimensions. And it sucks, oh. because then you can't do anything, because you need those other mobs. Yeah. Which, I, I I don't know how to fix that at all. That's the issue. Like. Um. Our trees aren't growing. Oh, I ran past, oh, coal. You yeah, found coal. I, I found some. Oh, well, I ran out of pickaxe. Yeah, so did I. Um, and I ran past the place where we're supposed to run up, and, uh. And our Trees aren't growing. Uh, that'll be fine. We'll get some more spawning soon. I can but see we light. need wood. I've got some. Oh, okay. Well, I've got plenty of stone, too. Yeah. I'll put stone in the chest. Okay. I oh, hope damn. I can't hear that. I hope you can't hear that. I can. Okay. Well, okay. we'll just cut to something interesting. Yep. Yeah. Actually, no. It's about that time. Oh, for a new episode? Yeah. Okay. Well, the episode. We'll just Go ahead and put some coal in there. I'm going to... How many planks do you need? I'm going to give you two. Let's make some iron pickaxes. Because uh, we'll waste less wood that way. I only need one plank, by the way. Oh, oh. shit. That's okay. Uh, could I have one um, more? I, I only need... I didn't mean do you to want drop a stick? all of my wood. Yeah, just give me two sticks. Okay. But, yeah. Uh, we should probably stick with the iron pickaxe. That way it doesn't waste as much wood. What are you talking about? Stone pickaxes break a lot sooner than iron ones do, so we can accomplish a lot more with iron. Oh, now you're getting too smart for me. And you used to be the engineer and the smart one in these games, dude. Why? Like, you're the terabyte how long, here. How long has it been since I played Minecraft? You're the terabyte of knowledge. How long has it been since I played Minecraft? Mm, I don't know, too long. Way too long. Yeah, probably. We can get back into it. Oh, there's something I really want to do, though, and I want to end it. Uh, before we end this episode, I want to extend an invite to everybody who is watching our videos, anybody who's our subscribers. Um, I've got a Minecraft map that I found, and it's a Funland Adventure Park. And what it is, it's basically just a giant amusement park with shit tons of rides and events and things to find. So I kind of want to hold, like, uh, my own Cedar Point in a way and have everybody <laughs> come out and come out and do it so this is my invitation to you um look for it on the channel we will post about it in eventually is we saying cedar point too close to home no well, no because a lot of people travel everybody's from point. ohio by the way everybody well except for mark applier from ohio oh yeah, that's a good jeremy point. lived in ohio but he wasn't from ohio he was from rose knows from about ohio rose knows about ohio <laughs> This I mean, let's life. face it. She... You mother... <laughs> Ooh, Ooh, I'm sorry, Rose. I'm going to cut that out, Rose. Don't worry. Yeah, yeah she's probably going to... Hey, future John, bleep that with... You mother... <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Man, I wish I referenced. Boy, that was a really John good Moore. joke. Yeah, I wish I didn't hear it. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, we need to end this episode. It's been about twenty minutes, and uh, oh, wow. I, I need to head to bed for the night. Yay! Got lots to do tomorrow. That's a lot more interesting and, than anything uh, happening. I'm gonna now. end this video now. We're just uh, cause we're gonna keep talking hours and hours on end. Um, <clears> but <throat> if you want to see more of this series feel free to leave a like or a comment. I'm going to put the link to the map in the description. And uh, you have anything else you want to add? Um, it's wet here. So am I. Thanks for watching, everybody. Well. <laughs> <laughs> See you next time. I ate purple berries. I shouldn't have. Don't eat the purple berries. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Look at his, his arms are like super fucking long. Like, oh my god. Dude. I just want to He has to no touch. skull, it's all brain. I just want to touch. <laughs> Look at those fingers, it's creepy as fuck. <laughs>